You can draw something like this with the simple tools and without watching many videos. Let's dive into it. Can you add? Add to inspire. Welcome back to my channel. Here at this community where we share tips and techniques to improve our drawing skills. Yeah, and for, and for all art lovers. Recently I made a video showing you the simple tools. There were four tips. If you missed it, we are just to view the video just before this one. Okay, before we dive into what we have for today, let me first thank all those who have just subscribed to my channel and all those who have supported me with the video with the viewing and commenting. Yeah, you give me courage and you empower me to do more and more of this content to help our fellow artists out there and art lovers. This is among my first drawings of animals and recently I said why not to start drawing animals and I started on the project. The first piece was chimpanzee. It was hyper realistic. If you watch the video, you can witness. Then I proceeded to this and many more still coming. But I discovered that, that I didn't have expensive tools, but I wanted to make or draw to the best of my skills. So I had to invest a lot of time and patience was a key factor to achieve what I wanted. So I started on a project and this is how it's running. Yes, I know for the beginners you are struggling to draw such pieces. Probably don't know how to draw the fur on a animal's body but it's just simple the same way you draw the human hair is the same approach you can use to draw something like this that's the way i use or oh, that's the method i use to draw the fur on this Just to make her mind recall of the tools we use, we use charcoal pencils and graphite. And uh, in the next video, I think I'm going to be showing you the way you can mix graphite and charcoal. But basically, charcoal is much needed to achieve the darkness we want because with the graphite, as I said in the recent video, it's hard to, for us to achieve the rich darkness. Yeah, because that graphite brings out that mirroring whatever, that mirroring, that mirroring surface, which is not good. But for charcoal, it is not seen. Still on tools, we need a Tombow Mono Zero razor. Yes, some of you, you know razor as rubber. Is it true? Yes. You can even comment in the comment section. Yeah, if I say a razor, some of you don't get me. I mean that rubber. Yes. And we need a sharpener because we always or we ought to sharpen every time. The other tools you are seeing around me, they are the brushes and a needable razor. A needable razor is that razor or that rubber, you know, which can be folded in, in all angles, yeah? And the brushes, they help us to blend our graphite or our charcoal smoothly. As you see, we can have a smooth tone on our drawing. Still, 
these brushes help us to save time because if you use the earbuds you find yourself that you use a lot of time to cover all the these stamps you, you will see that you take a lot of time to shed or to blend the strokes made by the charcoal pencils but we can save time when we use graphite and we add on a little bit of the powder as you see me I'm doing I get powder and add on the strokes using my my brush as you see you too can do that yes let's also see how we can use the Tomomono Zero Laser this helps us to highlight to highlight this far or to make the light strokes on our drawing as you see I'm doing I use this Tombow Mono Zero razor to highlight the skin or to highlight if I'm doing on a project like this I highlight the fur those light those are uh, those light can I call them hairs which are going in different directions you can't draw them using that black charcoal pencil but you can also draw them using white charcoal pencils but some of you I know you don't have them as me too <laughs> I have them but yesterday but you can make these strokes to make our work so realistic using this Tombow Mono Zero Razor it's not expensive you can buy it in the nearby art shop you see around in Uganda it's around 25,000 how many dollars there and one thing you have to know is that you don't need expensive tools or you don't need to watch many videos to start off the journey you just need to start off with those two or three tools you have and that or this video you have just watched it's enough for you to begin i know you have been practicing continue you will see the goods of persistence just persist on what you are doing i believe in you and i know you can make it yes you can comment in the comment section and i will do just what you want to me share with you yes subscribe to support this community yes for many more is still coming